Hello everyone, we are messing around with live stream and we are driving in our truck. We are in, um, make sure I can, my wife is in here, Rio Recreational Vehicles LLC. Um, and we are um, down in oh Galveston gosh. Island and we're getting ready for this deep freeze that's supposed to hit Texas, um, northern part of Texas. You might already be feeling it, but we're at 68 degrees here in Galveston. Um, as the cold front is pushing in. Just wanted to touch base with you, reach out, and let you know what you should be doing if you're staying in an RV tonight and you're anticipating teens, okay? And you're not in some place where you're skirted up and ready to, you know, endure an entire winter. Um, if you don't have an electrical water hose, make sure you fill your tank and disconnect all your hoses. Ooh, we just got up on our screen on our truck. A wind advisory has been issued for Houston, Trinity, Madison, Walker, San... San... <laughs> 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 Washington, Grimes, Montgomery, Liberty, Colorado, Wow. So, Basic, basically every county in Texas. Yeah, so, um, bring everything in, um, especially if you're on the coast here. Uh, we got gale force winds anticipated. So I took down all the pretty Christmas lights, um, tucked everything under. We've got, you know, basically almost like a move day. We've got everything packed away. Um, we're gonna make sure that our generator has fuel in it and that it's running. Make sure we have our 30 amp converter out in the event that we do have to convert off of shoreline power and go to a generator to keep things running. Um, you, you should have some waste in your, um, especially if you don't have a heated underbelly, we are in a four season rig. So as long as our furnace is running, we're good. Make sure you have extra propane in case this endures a little bit longer because oftentimes there becomes a shortage of availability to grab propane. Better to get it now than to run out. You will be surprised how much propane you're gonna go through. Yeah. Don't depend on space heaters. Space heaters will not heat your underbelly. Okay, so you need to have your furnace running. I know a lot of you are propane resistant, but <laughs> you have to be running your propane furnace in order to heat your underbelly. Otherwise, you leave your pipes and tanks exposed to the element. Now, thankfully, this is not going to be a February 2020 deep freeze where it lasts for five days. We're only anticipating about 36 hours and not that many hours of actually below 32 degree temperatures. That's the pro it's the prolonged cold that is going to get us. Um, if you do not have a four season rig, put a tarp or something around, create some sort of skirting, whatever you can, you know, if you got coolers, if you got stuff like that that you can put around the edges, especially where your tanks and your hoses are exposed. Um, that Anticipate not going out. We could have. 
have ice on the ground. So make sure you have just an adequate amount of, you know, food supplies. channel. We look forward to seeing you guys. We're off to Walmart to 